Hi, today we're sketching polynomials. So let's look what we have here for number one. Notice that we have x plus three squared, x minus five squared. So the multiplicity over here is two on both of them. That means we're gonna have just a quadratic function right here, just a little cute smiley face right there going through negative three and another one that goes there at five because negative three and five, they're my roots. Notice that I still have my x to the fourth power. That's the degree of that one polynomial I'm sketching, but it doesn't go through negative three. It just touches negative three and it touches five. This one is easier than number one. Um, so it's just a regular cubic function, but it's negative. So it goes down going through negative two and goes down. Let's see. Um, let's look at number six. So number six, I have three zeros of the function or three roots, one at zero right there because X equals zero right there. X equals negative two from over here. And then X equals positive one. How do I graph this? Well, it's opening downward because it's negative and it's to the fourth power. So uh, it goes up, down, up, and then down again. Now, I like to start out by looking at that two, the exponent two that I see right there. So I know it's gonna be a quadratic shape right there at that two. So it will only touch right there at the negative two. It only touches right there at negative two, and then I have to go up, through zero and then down through one and then facing down because that was my sketch. Let's see what else I have. Um, number eight is another good one too. So number eight is another one to the fourth power because I have three on the exponent here and an invisible one that makes uh, number eight the degree of four because three plus one is four, the degree of four. Um, the zeros of the function will be negative three and positive two. So it's going to be a cubic function shape, like going through negative three right there. So it goes through with the wiggles. You can see my white out right there because I have a really hard time with the shape of the cubic function, but it should look like that. So, and because it's positive on number eight, it's positive, so it opens upward, but you have to make sure that it goes through and it has the shape of the cubic function right there at the negative three root. And then it goes through two right there and opening up in the end. Um, another one, 10, and that's gonna be the last one. So it's to the fourth power, it's negative, so it's open down, opening downward. So the roots are zero and three, zero from over here, and then three from over there, zero on the X and three from the um, X minus three. And notice that the cubic right there on the X minus three, that means your shape has to be in the shape of a cubic function right there going through, th going through three, and then the root zero right there just complements to the shape of the quadratic, the 